In the air conditioning industry, we've all seen it. Heavy rust and corrosion on external compressor units. During this instructional video, we're going to show you an easy step-by-step -step process of protecting the cabinets, circuit boards and coils of external compressor units. This information will allow you to give better service to your customers and provide a further income stream to your businesses. Action Corrosion manufacture and supply a complete range of rust removers and premium protective coatings. We also have a service team who specialise in commercial rust removal and metal protection. We have clients in the mining industry, Hamilton Island maintenance teams, Mantra resorts and hotels. We also advise and assist Sydney Aquarium in respect of maintenance and restoration projects. Our service teams apply protective coatings to LG commercial installations and our products are recommended by LG to their clients. Project 1 is protecting new cabinets from rust and corrosion. First thing we do to protect this unit is to protect the PC boards, which we do with Action Vapor Guard. What we do is remove the lid, then a light spray over the top of all the boards to give you 12 to 18 months protection. The first step is to isolate the power and unscrew and remove the lid. Once the lid is removed, it's a simple case of spraying a light coating of vapour guard over all the circuit boards. Uh, the protector that we do use to protect the whole outside of these is Action Clear Coat. It comes in aerosol form or can be purchased in liquid form. Now the liquid form can be brushed on or can be put directly in a spray gun and sprayed as it is. This clear coat goes over the entire cabinet, over the fan guards, the coil guards, the lid and on the feet. First of all, we evenly spray the lid, the front and the sides of the cabinet. Next we spray the fan guards and ensure that the welds are well coated. Next we coat the coil guards on the side and the back of the unit. Next, coat the feet of the unit. Next, we coat all the screws on the unit. Off-in protection is very important in maintaining the unit's efficiency. When the aluminium fins corrode, they form white oxidation which traps sand, salt, dirt and disrupts airflow. By coating with Action Clear Coat, you're providing excellent corrosion protection without compromising heat exchange in the coil. Project 2 is protective treatment of commercial units. On this particular project we have uh, Dakin air conditioners, Fujitsu's and an unknown brand here. Uh, they pretty much all have the same issues when it comes to corrosion. Uh, the fan guard is usually one of the first things to corrode but fortunately in this instance all have the plastic fan guards. 
Uh, the other area of concern is the coil guard on the side. We find that that corrodes really easily and the screws are fixing. These units here are three years old, so they're starting to um, they're starting to fade and they're starting to chalk up. As you can see, if you rub the top of the uh, of the units, you can see that the powder is starting to come off the units, which means that the uh, the powder coating is deteriorating, and soon will the rust will set in. The other part, or the other section of the unit that we look at, is the the feet of the unit. Once again, these are off the ground, so they're not going to be as exposed to rust and corrosion as uh, the ones that are on the ground. So what we're going to do, we're going to use our uh, clear coat, which is comes in aerosol, liquid form. But because we've got so many units here, we're actually going to put in a spray gun, uh, and we're going to spray the outside of these units. What it'll do, it'll give it UV protection. It'll make them shiny. It's a clear, hard coating. Unlike lanolin and oil products, dust, salt, and uh, impurities will not stick to the unit. Circuit boards in an air conditioner are one of the most expensive components to replace. Corrosion is the number one cause of failure due to high moisture and humidity in the unit. If the compressor is in a coastal location, the threat of circuit board corrosion increases. Another threat to circuit boards are vermin. Many of our clients report that geckos in particular are shorting out boards as they seek a dry, warm environment to live. By applying Action Vapor Guard to circuit boards every 12 to 18 months, You'll prevent corrosion and deter geckos who absolutely hate the smell of the product. So to treat the electronics, the PC boards, we use Action Vapor Guard, which is here. It's a simple process. We isolate the power. Usually the PC boards are located on the top of the unit. Leave the cover plate up, it doesn't have to be taken off totally. If you zoom in there, come in closer, can you see the PC boards in there? Yep. And what we do is a light spray. all the PC boards and that's done as far as the electrics go. This section deals with mild to medium rust removal of compressor units. For rust removal we use Action Rust Removal Gel. Some products make claims to be outstanding rust removers but our gel is by far the best. It is not watery like other removers you find in a hardware store. We designed it thick. So it will stick to the cabinet until the rust is dissolved and it is hosed off. The next video will show you just how effective it really is. In this demonstration we will treat the heavily rusted base of the coil guard, a section of the lid edge and a rusted foot of this unit.
After only five minutes, the gel has started dissolving the rust. After just 10 minutes, the gel has removed most of the rust. After just 15 minutes, the rust is totally gone. The gel's done a great job and left us with bare metal. Simply a case of just rinsing off with water and once dry, applying Action Clear Coat to protect it. Project 4 is removing corrosion from coil fins. Once again we'll be using Action Rust Removal Gel to remove the corrosion. It's a very straightforward process this one. What we're trying to achieve is a nice thick coat of Action Rust Removal Gel directly onto the rusted fins. As you do this you will see that the product will foam and what that is that's a reaction between the product and the corrosion on the aluminium fins. After 20 minutes to half an hour the fins are ready to be rinsed off. You will note in this demonstration that the fins to the left that haven't been cleaned are still corroded and on the right hand side where we have cleaned uh, they're back to their natural colour. Project 5, stabilising cabinets with heavy rust. In this example the rust has gone through the lid in sections and the powder coating has lifted from the metal. It cannot be repaired but our treatment will stop it getting any worse. It will also stop rust bleeding on the surrounding tile. Rust flakes contain moisture. The first step is to remove that moisture by wiping the unit over with thinners. While swiping over the cabinet, remove any loose rust. The final step is to apply two very heavy coats of the clear coat liquid directly onto the rust. The reason why Action Clear Coat Liquid is preferred over the aerosol type is to give a greater film thickness over the rusted areas. Once treated, the coating soaks into the rust and leaves a shiny protective coating which prevents further rust and will stop bleeding onto the tiles surrounding the unit.
Just to recap, we've only used three products in this demonstration. One is the clear coat protector, which we used on the cabinets. That comes in liquid form or aerosol form. The other product we've used is Action Vapor Guard for the electronics. We've used that on all the PC boards in the demonstrations. And the third product was the rust removal gel that we used on the cabinets to remove rust. And then you hose it off and then apply the clear coat afterwards. We manufacture these products and we supply direct. So if you'd like further information, you can go to www.actioncorrosion.com.au or you can contact our sales team on 1300 731 311. Thank you.